Welcome back, Chronics, and thanks for joining me. So today, I'm sharing an article that I read out of Tulane University in Louisiana. The Southern Hospitality. Seems reputable. I don't want to get my hopes up, but I'm not not getting my hopes up. It just seems too good to be true. They found the reason for hypermobile EDS. For real? So the researchers think this is a possible cause. A folate deficiency may cause certain proteins not to attach to collagen, resulting in more elastic everything. Could it be that simple? These researchers definitely have street cred, seeing as though they have a hypermobile Ehlers-Danlos syndrome clinic at Tulane. So like a whole clinic. The whole place. They may know a thing or two. We see this all the time. Really? Great news. Treatment already exists. It's benign, but in the methylfolate form. I just got some just in case. I thought I'd just try it to be the guinea pig. You know, because you guys would want to know, so. Again with the guinea pig. What do we have to lose? Long story short, the patients that did have unmetabolized folate did have this gene. You know, that one. I don't, I don't know how you say that. More lab research and clinical testing is needed, but it's a start. Look, we have to start somewhere. Subsequently, patients treated with B9 reported less pain, less brain fog, fewer allergies, and fewer gastrointestinal symptoms. So the idea is this vitamin could really help us. We gave them vitamins. Seriously? A vitamin? Bottom line, this is exciting news. <gasps> That's amazing! That's amazing news! I'm going to start taking B9 today, and I will let you guys know if I feel any better. Fingers crossed! Thank you guys for joining me. I really appreciate it. And remember, stay true to yourself and don't take crap from anyone. See you guys next time.